welcome back to The Gerbil Vine. Thank you all so much for being here today and for clicking on this video. A very special thank you um, to those of you who have stuck around and waited while um, we were on a mini break and we were trying to get our shit together and feel a bit better. So thank you to all of you who are still subscribed to our channel. While I'm not sure that we will still be uploading um, weekly, I do have a couple cool video ideas coming up in the near future. So definitely be on the lookout for that. So anyways, just a quick update. I still have my two gerbils. Jerry and Dusk are still doing really great. They're loving their home. They're thriving. They've got a different 12 inch wheel in there. I was using the 11 inch night angel wheel, um, but it just like started making a lot of noise. So I ended up giving it to my hamster and she's able to run on it without it making like a peep at all. So I'm not entirely sure what was going on with that. But so anyways, today we're back with a bit of a fun video. You might have seen our little announcement on our community tab page where we did receive a package from Pet Connection International. If you guys remember a couple months ago, we sent over a package to them and they decided to reciprocate and send us a package back. So we've got the package here today and we're going to be opening it up and seeing what they sent us. So before we get started, please make sure that you like and subscribe so that you never miss our uploads. All right, so let's try to open this box here. I'm not really sure best way. So it looks like on the top here, we've just got these two little envelopes. So we'll start with those. So it seems we've got a little letter here and it says, to Bex, Jerry, and Dusk, we hope this parcel reached you in good time and that it all stayed safe on the long haul. We love choosing some of our favorite supplies for you all to try out. We didn't include any food items just in case it caused problems at customs, so we hope Jerry and Dusk like the toys. We tried to find things that you may not have tried before as well as some obvious winners. We've also included a little something for you in honor of your <laughs> Scottish heritage as well as some stickers for your tank and a copy of Timon and Pumbaa's first berry painting. I wanted to send you the original, but they peed on me. <laughs> but they peed on it. Oh my god. Uh, we hope you all like everything. Wishing you the best. Heather and Pumbaa plus Timon. May she rest in peace. This is their first berry painting. So it looks like I'm going to assume they stepped in berries and then just walked on the paper. Super cute. Um, what an adorable idea. I love that. Thank you. They're just these um, Mongolian gerbil um, fact sheets. And I believe that Pet Connection International does have an Etsy shop open now. So I'll link that down below in my description if you want to go and check it out for yourself and order yourself an item such as this. There are a couple other varieties that she was telling me about and they all look really cool. So if you're interested in some cool gerbil facts and stickers, um, definitely go and check out that shop. I plan on rearranging my room soon. So I'm going to have to um, set up my gerbil corner. I have like a couple other gerbil items to hang too. So I think that this would go really nice in the gerbil corner once I set it up. So thank you so much for these. And then we've just got this little envelope here and it's this really cute little keychain. It's absolutely adorable. My key ring is like filled with keychains because like, I love keychains and stuff. So thank you so much for that. That's totally cool and totally unique and I appreciate it. It's like a little gift for me. So we'll start with this one that says open me. Oh, and this is cool. So it looks like it is a foraging toy made from bamboo, poplar, wood circles, and beech wood beads. That's a really cute little hanging toy, and it looks like it has their logo on it. So I wonder if this is going to be like a future item in their store. So curious to know about that, but I think that that's totally cute. Uh, my gerbils love hanging toys. They love nibbling them. So this one is going to go right into their topper and it just opens like that. Um, so super cute and easy. So love that for them. Thank you so much for this. This is adorable. So next it looks like we've got quite a big item here. This is just a seagrass three-way tunnel. These are super cute. Not really something that you see often um, in our Canadian pet stores. They do have a couple items like this but um they're more like larger like for rabbits or guinea pigs and stuff so this is super cool um they'll definitely love this and definitely go to town on it so their next tank queen definitely gonna put this in thank you so much this is such a cool item and i love all of the multiple entrances and exits so it's not just like a tunnel one tunnel straight through it's really nice and it's really large um so love this and seagrass is a great natural material for your gerbils to chew on and something that they definitely love as it's 
and crunchy and definitely will entice them to chew it. So beautiful and love this item. Thank you so much. So we've got a couple items left in the box, including these two little small bull rush balls. I've never heard of this type of material, but it basically just looks like a hay or like a woven um, grass type material. So the dribbles are definitely going to love this. There's no doubt about that. So thank you so much. These are definitely going to be a fan favorite as my dribbles love any type of like hay or grass or like woven ball material. This is super cute. It's like an interesting little like multi-pack of items. So in here you've got a stick bundle, four corn leaf pom-poms, four rat tin balls, a wooden carrot, and a loofah tractor. All of these items are really great and totally safe for your gerbils. Love the multiple willow balls and the corn leaf chews. That's really cute. So is that little carrot absolutely adorable. And the final item that we have is all of these fruit and veggie chews. And it looks like they're dyed naturally just based on... Um, the colorings and the way that they look. Color staining may occur, so that usually means that they're dyed naturally because um, the color is transferable. So I love this and I can't wait to give this to them too. They love wooden shoes. Love, love, love them. We got our little Jerry, little superstar. So as you can see, they have found the little woven seagrass balls. Hey Jerry, you're perfect. Oh, well, aren't we going to town on that little ball down there? That's okay. As you can see, they definitely love all of their new stuff, so they definitely say thank you so much to Pet Connection International and Pumba for sending over all those really cool goodies. So thank you all so much for watching our video today. If you watched until the very end, thank you so, so much for being here. Like I said, we have a couple really cool video ideas coming up in the near future, which includes comparing our, comparing gerbils day and night activity levels, some really cool enrichment ideas that you can do for your gerbils. And then I plan on doing an overhaul of safe food and treats that you're able to feed to your gerbils. So that's also something to look out for. Then I'll be doing a in-depth video on a split tank method, how to know when they've had enough time in the split tank and all that stuff so definitely look out for that video. A huge huge thank you to Heather and Pumba over at Pet Connection International. Again I will link their channel down below but we appreciate all the really cool items that you sent us. So thank you so much for thinking of us and when we sent the package over we definitely weren't expecting anything to be sent back. We just wanted to do something nice for a fellow good gerbil YouTuber. I think that it's really good that we promote and encourage each other when we know that the other person is practicing good care and it's something we support and I think it's really great that we're able to sort of come together and form like a YouTube friendship over our love and passion for gerbils and animal welfare in general. As always, make sure that you like and subscribe so that you never miss our uploads and we'll see you in our next video. Thank you! Bye!